hello guys today we are going to do java program for fluid triangle so let me show you what is fluid triangle as you can see this pattern is called fluid triangle it is start with one and go down with the each row with its consecutive numbers suppose one two three four five six and so on so we'll do java program for to print this pattern or this fluid triangle pattern so let me start We will create a new project here. It would be normal Java application. Let me just give name as Floyd Triangle. Click on finish. So we'll ask user to enter a number or range. Till that range we'll going to print the row. So we'll start. We'll require an import statement here. Import Java dot util dot scanner class. Let me declare four variable. It would be int i, j, k should be defined equal to one and num. We'll also create a scanner class object. Scanner user input is equal to new scanner here. System dot in. Now we just go ahead and print the message. System dot out dot print. Enter number of rows. So rows define how many layers in the triangle. So now we just store the value into num user input dot next int here. Now we require for loop here for i is equal to one. I should be less than equal to num i plus plus. We'll also require a inner loop. So we'll define it for j is equal to 1 j should be less than equal to i and j plus plus but for printing we will also increment k value here so we'll just write comma and write k plus plus every time in this program we will going to print k value so let me just print the k value here system dot out dot print After completing this loop, we'll just add new line here. System dot out dot print here. Let's save it. Let's go to run and clean and build the project here. And go to run and test the application. Here it is asking enter number of rows. Let me enter five here. So as you can see, this pattern is printed till five layers of triangle: one, two, three, four, five, six, and so on. If you like this video, please like and comment about it, and also subscribe for this channel to get notified for every new tutorial. Thank you.